Of course, as we know, long before number 45 entered the White House, white supremacy and anti-blackness were already everywhere. These are some of the reasons why I'm running for city council. To fight for justice, to speak the truth about our past and present, to lift up the voices of the most marginalized people in our city, and to fight for a Philly we all deserve. A city where everyone can thrive regardless of the identities they hold. Look at the old West Philly High School that is now luxury condominiums. These developments prove that people who hold elected office currently are invested in profits over people and that institutional and economic racism is the reason for the divestment from education here in Philadelphia. We need to pay workers at least $15 an hour if we're invested in people living a decent life. Now I know that's not enough, but it's something we must fight for as the minimum as we think collectively about what it means to pay workers a living wage. That we care so little about our long-term residents and our young people is a moral crisis. This is why I'm calling for an end to the 10-year property tax abatement. Yeah. Mass incarceration drives our high rates of poverty, as does our affordable housing and eviction crises. Evictions like incarceration become a mark on people's records that follow and haunt them as they try to stabilize their lives. We must support and push for expanded decriminalization of marijuana. We have to address the stigma that is often attached to sex work. And besides the racism and transphobia that is its cause, so too is the fact that so many are engaged in sex work due to the employment discrimination they face in so many other areas of work. Thank you everyone. Thank you everyone. Thank you. 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 Thank you